what's going on guys we are going to be having the eclipse today uh me and marigold are going to go up to the theater here in town they just rebuilt the old dp drive-in theater they're doing a little thing during the eclipse where they're going to play pink floyd dark side of the moon while the eclipse is happening me and sister are going to go up there and hang out with my mom my sister bennett and watch the eclipse and listen to pink floyd while it's happening it's going to be pretty cool i think and i'm also got my sony camera and i have a sun lens i'm gonna put on the front of it i don't know how well it's gonna work but i'm gonna try to actually record the eclipse so we'll see what happens we'll see if this turns out right He's got the ball. Oh, he's got the ball. He's got the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Oh, get him! Get him! Oh, get him! Don't mind my yard, guys. I've really got to cut the grass. I have literally not touched my yard this year at all. My mower's are at my sister's. I think I may, no, I haven't told him. I may have said, I can't remember, but it's at my sister's and it got messed up last year, so you have to wrap the string around it but it's okay i need to get it so i can cut this grass i may actually do that today definitely this week right it needs to happen <laughs> you almost did a front flip trying to stop where'd it go i guess i guess where'd it go where'd it go i guess where'd it go i guess where'd it go i guess where'd it go where'd it go, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go bubba where'd it go Where'd it go? Where'd it go? You can smell it. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of out this hole hurt, Doug. I don't know what he was digging for. Uh, it's like a foot and a half deep. Come on, bro. My yard is bad, 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 bad. Look at that. I mean, it's not horribly bad. It'll be fairly easy to cut, but if I keep letting it go any much longer, it's just, look how green and thick these gra this grass grew back. This was all trees. I cleared all that out like two years ago, three years ago. Literally from right here, that way was full of trees. I cleared that completely out. And we keep getting these, these flowers growing all over our yard look how many buds are on them and they're all over the place look in my wood pile a whole bunch of them this is literally the first year since we've lived here that i've seen those purple flowers popping up like that and then we got some other ones up front i'll show you like, i don't even know what these are these are some type of flowers i think or just a plant maybe because you know back in the day if you look like right here there's foundation well, I guess this was a fence, but it was fenced in. So I'm pretty sure there was a house here, maybe a couple houses right here. So they had like plants and flowers planted out in front of their house. And that's what these are. I'm gonna show you these ones that pop up in front of our yard. It's crazy how they're all blooming out this year. Like they've always grown, but it's always just been the leaves. Like those ones that just look like plant. Like see, they just look like that. These were the first ones to pop up, but these ones. And they close up, they close up, and they open up every day. So at nighttime, they close into all these little balls, and then during the day when the sun comes out, they flare out like that. Isn't that so cool? I seriously think that these are some kind of flowers or plants that were planted here long, 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 long time ago that are just there, right? They come back every single year. But like I said, this is the first time that I've seen them actually flower out like that. What kind of flowers are they, guys? I'm sure somebody, one of y'all guys, one of y'all girls know what kind of flowers they are. Look, they're all over the place. These little white flowers. I think they're popping up every single word. It's crazy, I didn't even know there were so many back here. Look, those are all bulbs. If they were to actually all flare out, man, that would be beautiful, little white flowers. What are those? I know that birds, how things like that happen sometimes too, birds will pick up seeds 
and get seedlings on them and they fly and they can go completely hundreds of miles away and drop seedlings and it makes that happen. Do you think that's what that is, guys? Let me know what you think. And if you know what kind of flowers those are, let me know. The purple one and the white ones. <laughs> The TP drive in. I've not been to the TP drive in since I was 12. I drove by there a hundred times, but I've not been there since I was young. We used to go there all the time. We used to go there. I remember we went and watched uh, the first Ghostbusters when it first came out. We went and watched it in the theater. It's freaking hot. And uh, Pretty Woman. We watched Pretty Woman. <laughs> Quit. Oh, because when we were out there, I remember I was sitting on the tailgate of my dad's truck on the end to watch the movie, and I had my arms inside of my shirt because it was a little bit chilly, and I fell face first off the tailgate Good. flat on my... All right, guys, we'll see you at the theater whenever we get to Mama T and Care Bear and Benny Benito. Let's do it! We is at the theater. This is where I used to come when I was a kid all the time. Check it out. Is the theater? I busted my face like right back there one day. What's up? What's up? What's going on? Mama T. Phone up to it. There's Care Bear. Hey. Check it out, y'all. Ready to see the eclipse, guys. I hope my camera does pretty well. That lens is not a real dark lens, so it may, it might be too bright, honestly. But we're still gonna give it a shot. Check out the old school campers. They got some old school classic campers back here. Imagine how cool it's gonna get when it's completely covered. You can feel the temperature drop already. Surprisingly, it feels a little bit chilly. I think it's supposed to drop like 10 to 12 degrees. Check out these campers. These are some sick campers. What's going on? Oh yeah, how about them? How about them cheese? Two time world champion. Oh wait, three time world three champion, time. sorry. Sorry, two in a row. Look at these campers, guys. That is so cool, man. How cool would it be to buy an old camper like this and restore it like that? Why do these look so much better than the new ones? And, and what's cool is there you can tell it's like just homemade redone. Does someone stay in these? Yeah, it's an Airbnb. Uh-uh. <laughs> Look at him, soaking up the Airbnb without paying for it. <laughs> Mom snapping pics. So these are Airbnb guys. These are, you can rent these and stay in them. Yeah, let's go look at this one. Oh yeah, check it out. This is the TP drive-in. Grew up my whole life coming to this place all the time when I was a kid. I like the shape of this one, but I like the color of that one. Uh, it reminds, yeah, it, it reminds me of that movie. What's that movie where everything's good, there's no bad? Pleasantville. That's what I was trying to come up with. Pleasantville, where everything's perfect. The TP like drive-in.
can't be no light if darkness don't exist he never left my side he showed me the way out of all the storms raging at the sea he gave me back my life I owe him everything Rejoice, rejoice, rejoice in the name of the Lord Forever and always I rejoice, rejoice, rejoice in the name of the Lord always He carried me to shore Held me through the pain He loved me at my worst I thank Him every day I will put Him first Cause He did that for me he sacrificed himself so I could find my peace. Rejoice, rejoice, rejoice in the name of the Lord forever and always. I rejoice. Showed us the way Gonna be live, you can watch me on YouTube. Well, we wanna go. All right, y'all, that was the eclipse. It's still actually still a little bit of an eclipse going on, but oh, it's just about past. But Jesus didn't tear the clouds open like everybody said was gonna happen. Eyes ready if you did, though. But ring me, Lord. Oh, wait. Did you dookie your pants, boy? Oh, you. <laughs> All right, we're headed to the house, and then me and Benny Benito is gonna go throw a line for a minute. Then we're gonna come back and do a Grounds with the Goats with a special guest. <laughs> Love you guys. Hey, what's going on guys? We are back now from the eclipse. Me and Bubba actually went fishing and Miracle and McKinley went fishing with us as well. And they actually used bait caster reels and did not mess them up. I mean, maybe a little bit, a couple times, but they did a lot better than I figured they would. I was really shocked when they showed up with those kind of fishing bowls. But anyway, so we watched the eclipse and we're still here and the lights are still on. So I don't know. We love you guys. Uh, I got a lot of stuff to do now. I've still got to go dashing. I've still got to edit. I got a bunch of stuff to edit now. I'm going to try to get this edited up and get up in the next couple days. Well, by this point, you'll be watching it, obviously, to be done. So, But this is Monday, so we'll see how fast I can get it up. We're about to do a ground with the goat right now and get it edited, get it up. It's got a lot going on. I love you guys. Thank you for hanging out, and uh, I hope you all had fun with the eclipse today. It was super cool, super crazy, and uh, love you guys. Stay blessed. Yesterday there was sun in 